is the man who could upset it. The man who beat him in Ukrainian nationals earlier this year. And he too is a superb talent. He's in sixth place. But he would have to be out of this world to beat Dimitrenko. Another one skating to uh, James Horner's The Mask of Zorro. Now this is Vitaly Danilchenko taking his time, composing himself, waiting until he's ready. and maybe he needed a quad. Now for the axle combination. No. He thought about it, turned it down. But he can always have a chance of putting it in later. Triple axle landed. Triple axle combination. And strength to land that triple loop. He yeah, shows some real fight there. Bad position on the takeoff edge. is his last chance of a medal gone.
Boy, is that boy fit. <laughs> well, he had everything that the earlier performance didn't have of Zorro. He was sharp and crisp and strong, particularly at the end. Six triples. It was some performance, and yet it just could have been that little bit better if he'd landed the triple towards the end. Perhaps he needed the quad to get the medal. I don't think he's going to overtake Dimitrenko. No, I think you're right. I don't think there's any chance that he can overtake Dimitrenko, but a, a fantastic performance. He worked so hard throughout of that routine. Some good quality jumps and a fantastic step sequence to end with. The choreography was superb. Here's a look at the axle again. He doesn't have a textbook position in the air, and you can see a real struggle on the landing. Rocked over onto the inside, but still managed to keep the foot off. Here's a look at the Lutz, a wonderful plant. And again, the legs not quite straight in the air, but a beautiful running edge coming out. And he puts so much feeling into the program. That's going to give him a great second mark. And the swordsmanship at the end was terrific, wasn't it? Yeah, it built, didn't it? The program got stronger and stronger and stronger. Superhuman, super fit. <laughs> Another one we're going to hear an awful lot more of. He was ninth last year. I think he's going to be just unlucky this year, but hold on. Marina Amakanova alongside on the left, and Irina Shuboritz, the choreographer, on the right. And the good thing is he looks pretty happy with what he's achieved. Now, how happy will the judges be? Five, five. Five, six, five, five, no, five, five, not good enough by some way. Four, five, three, He's going to miss out. Four, five, and uh, Marina knows it straight away, five, comforting six, him. Eight, and it means that Dimitrenko, five, six, and I'm so pleased, is going to get a medal. It's probably, almost certainly going to be the bronze, because hang on to your hats for what we've to come. The two best skaters in the world are just about to take the ice. But Dimitrenko is locked in for the bronze medal.